Wouldn't bet on Peter winning that fight. It took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Hold on. You don't remember? I remember sparring against the Celestial Madonna in a small village. And then the cold darkness of the promise devouring my soul. Until you found me. Yeah, you missed a lot. My shoulders are sore. Yeah, Mantis is heavier than she looks. How is she connected with my soreness? <laughs> she rode your back all the way down the caves to Goldie's place. Really? Hey, Gooch. Did you reach Cosmo? Explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Deceased wife and daughter are with me. To thank the matriarch for her gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land at the space park. Them bars and betting parlors and noodle joints. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks. I assume it will be worse. Raker rallies regiments while we wait, whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, go. What the flark? Great cocoon boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. Hey, Starscut, I hope you appreciate me more after all that. So, final showdown against Raker. This time, you'll get him for good. I intend to. We're not leaving here without Nikki. You take care of the Milano, okay? Make sure the ship's still here when we come back. Ready, Drax? I am. My blades are as sharp as the rodent's tongue. Was that a metaphor? It was a simile. Your kid sure got herself in a deep quill. Her mom died, man. If Warlock's telling the truth, that thing inside her is using Corel's death to manipulate her. I get it. Ain't gonna be easy getting her out of there, but I'll die trying. Just so you know, I'll do everything I can to save her girl. I, I know it's important to you. 
I am Groot. Groot wants you to know he'll do all he can to save your kid. You know what? I think I kind of understood that. Let's do this. Time to save Nikki. Peter. Okay. Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Welcome, travelers. Have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and cleared to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! been very busy redecorating. All the more reason for us to get to the Cortex and find Nikki. Scott! Cosmos Tower's shut down. Are you good? That's because it's never been dark before. You do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security? This does not bode well for the dog. Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. If Cosmo is on their side, getting to the Cortex could be a lot harder. The Church believes they have already won. We must use that to our advantage. Or maybe they have won and we're just walking to our deaths? Rejoice, Rodent, for our final battle will be glorious. Kinda dreading what we're gonna see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but... Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but these crooks were suspicious of anyone giving them anything for free. You're right, Rocket. The people who lived here were rough. I once saw someone beat someone else to a pulp because they gave them a compliment. No way they'd willingly join up. A sword to the throat can be very convincing. They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hell's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from them. So they're powering something. Sure looks like it. Okay. I think we got the drop on these guys. Do not fear death. Don't need 
the deeper we go. 100 units says they're tied to the fulfillment. The priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. I've been thinking about what Warlock said. Which part? He hasn't stopped talking since we met him. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through... Close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There's no way through this wall. Whoa! Peter! Well, that didn't work. I'm going in. What about the fanatics? Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Let's hope it holds. Oh, God! Not Mantlo's. Look at her. This is personal. I had a contact here, rotations ago. You did? Was it Blur? No, no, no. Shut up and... What? Maybe? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cat free. He always gave Groot. There has been no sign of Goldie Braun since he leapt from our ship. Adam Warlock. Might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Or maybe he was lying about which side he was on and was waiting to attack. The Warlock carries an old grudge. Would not align himself with the Grand Fire. What do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. My memory is flawless. Sweet, nearly not. complete. Ha! Warlock's stronger than any of us, and he's got a pretty good reason to hate Raker. Looks like the church is trying to keep us out of there. That's not gonna work. Whoa. The Emporium used to be right here. Did the church destroy it? Doubt it. The Collector probably blasted out of here at the first sign of trouble. Before the first song. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. From the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Maybe Raker's trying to reanimate the Celestial Head, bring it back to life. Perhaps he wishes to turn it into a ship. Bah, this thing's deader than dead. It ain't coming back and it ain't jumping through no hyperspace. They say Celestials are powered by hyperspace. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. We will have to be ready for them to try and stop us. The converted ones will be prepared to die in order to bring their loved ones back to life. Which is pretty ironic if you think about it. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy, flark family? not garbage. Behold the power 
brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos! It's about Nikki, and what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his protecting hand. By me. your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. 
One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... kind of enjoyed being on. All things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... She loves us. <sighs> I did not. You did? You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I can take. We accept you, Gamora Zenwubri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. Let's say we go stop a nut job cult leader. Yes. Get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. Drax? I have been eager to topple something over. So, Gamora... Are you... Really? A faith force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking, then. You know... I usually hated when that Cosmo spotlight would shine down on me, but now I kind of miss it. I did not know you were so sentimental. Almost drowning changes me. 
That's it, Peter. Let's go. We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. All right, get ahead. Let's book it. Now is not the time for the. <laughs> <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The Matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start. She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kinda hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her. But you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. Foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous. Oops.
Keep them busy! Now it's Nova! They're gonna need a huge recruitment drive after this! Um, how many times have I saved your butt now? Not going into the light this time, little buddy! Do your thing, Gamora! Aggression is often the best protection! Had to be done! Heads up! Okay! We gotta get to that elevator! I'm gonna have to use the rooftop! So many lousy angles to cover! I will fight them! Rocket! Nuke them! Aratsis will tell Tales Just about once I'd like to cross this bridge without incident! The warlock saved us from certain death. Uh, I ain't scared of Raker and his little white dog. Hold him down! This has got my name on it! Lay on the hurt! Get down here, you Centaurian shark guard! We need to bring him in for an emergency landing! Well, I guess Goldie survived that jump! Did you see Raker's face when he showed up? See? We don't need Golden Boy's help. Is that why you shot him? <laughs> oh yeah, that was great. Right in the butt. Did you see the look on his face? It was all like, oh, my gilded glutes. Regal Rear is perfect posterior. His champion. Look out! Giving up. Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. I am Groot. Uh, Groot thinks we'll be nowhere royalty once we save it. Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way. Look, there's still air. Drax seems to be winning. Ba -ba -ba boom baby! You sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. Must suck to be a celestial head, just floating around the edge of the universe's stuck toilet. And then parasites move in and build a space station, they start digging out your brains. Well, you gotta be farkin' kidding me. The battle must be tremendous. Is any of this structurally sound? 
Something tells me it never was. Yep, that's part of nowhere's charm. We're so close. Don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Are you kidding? After the fit you threw last time? The same like the last time. You all... I trust you guys. Leave this to me! Whoa! Glad that wasn't rocket! You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. You will regret it. How dumb are these Flartnards to even fall for this full Flarkment garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise, too. That endless... hunger. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask yourself. This isn't going to end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! You count him out to your yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. The beast is being exposed to promise! No! Get away from my dog! Yet. We gotta 
Keep them off, Cosmo! Cut them down! What the fuck are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this Fleabag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... <laughs> Take him out before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Ah, uh, oh, fuck it. Just shoot the mutts. <sighs> Easy, bud. Friends, remember? Is Piotr cool? Cosmo knows never lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? Smell of nowhere. Where else would we be, fur brain? His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky and cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma. How you say? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden. Just walkies for going. And the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Nowhere is your home. Right here and now. Nowhere is nothing. Dead hit. Mind for scrap. It's way more than that. This place is special. If by met you mean I saved your bark, then... Yeah, we met here. It's true. Nowhere was first place since Earth. Cosmo not feel like stray dog. First time Cosmo forget what was lost. This place is a haven for misfits like us. Like you. It's home. Earth is just some rock where you were born. It's not about rock. It's about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day, family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet... You had owners. It sounds like they gave you up. Family would never turn back on Cosmo. I lost my family too. My mom died right in front of me when I was just a kid. Then Piotr Quill should know. Cosmo would work like a dog to his family back. If they are part of this promise, these humans are most assuredly dead. Do not be swayed by the bribe of their return as I was. Promise is only empty until fulfillment be. Perhaps it's Katadia who lost hope too quickly. <sighs> Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Piotr Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fetch your lies. That's it, buddy. You tell him. Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family. We'll protect the dog cause. Sick him, boy! Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex.